Hey, it's Amanda here from Blogs by Jarvis. So just to explain the content planners very, very quickly uh, for Surfer SEO, here I've run a content planner for the seed keyword stock images, and it's given me 206 clusters for the main topic. These are sorted by most relevant. You can also sort them by volume, high or low, and you can filter them here for intent, things like um, customer investigation, informational, shopping. So if you were writing for an affiliate site, you'd probably want to choose customer investigation and make those your priority articles. So here, each one is a tile and each tile has a cluster of keywords that Google wants to be included in the article to make the article rank. So those keywords need to be ranked together. Once you've chosen which clusters or which tiles you're going to use rather, you can create your content editor here and your content editor will um, is basically the structure for writing the blog post. So let's just go and quickly have a look at one of those. So I'm going to choose best images for Facebook ads. No, let's have a look. Social media images, I like that one. So let's create a content editor for that. This is running a little bit slowly at the moment, but only because of the new brief function. So the new brief function is basically what gives you the entire structural structure of your article. And now, okay, so the content editor is ready. So I'm going to click here to open the content editor. And that's going to give me all of the keywords that need to be used here and the number of words that are required, headings, paragraphs, images, and everything. But if we go into the new brief function and we just let that load, that's actually going to tell us exactly what we need to write. While that's doing that, you can see here the competitors that um, Surf has looked at, and also the topics and questions. So think about these as your people, people also asked. So you can actually just take these and copy them across. Sorry, copy paste them straight into your article here, Let's get rid of this. And then under the guidelines, you can already see that we've already got a score of 40 and we haven't even written a word. So the brief is still loading here. So we'll just give that a moment and come back to that in a second. Okay, so now the brief is finished building, you can see here that we've got H1, H2, H3 and H4. So H1 is basically the headings that are being suggested for this article. So uh, we can scroll through and choose any of these. This is kind of like if you think about Jarvis when you start the long form editor and Jarvis gives you suggested uh, titles and paragraphs. So I'm gonna take this one, suggested practices for eye catching social media, and you can just click that and it'll pop it across. It does format that as a heading though, so let's just make that normal. And then you can go onto the H2s. So this is quite good. So let's put this one here. That's not really relevant. Facebook image sizes, LinkedIn image sizes, Twitter image sizes, these are perfect. Google image sizes, um, image size of image we size at all. Um, Use of words in social media images. Some facts and figures. Using the right tools. So you can just go out and build this article. So that's a ton of content already. So if we look at the guidelines, wow, look, we're at 69 and I haven't even written a word. 69. And we've already hit quite a lot of these terms. So we can just carry on building that out. We can go to H3s. Uh, components of a successful image, where can you find images for your social media posts, best way to, place to find stock photos, obviously stock photos was our, or stock images was our seed word, seed word. So you can just carry on like this, just and just keep building it out and that score is going to go up and up to 72 already. So um, if you listen to the guys from Surfer, they'll tell you that if you're hitting 75, then stop. Just get to 75, tidy it up a little bit, get it published, write another one. So you can just literally go through all of these paragraphs now, take this into uh, Jarvis um, and you can rewrite, you can use the perfect headline or website, website subheadline 
to uh, redo the titles. This is a really, really long title. And then just rewrite these paragraphs, add your own secret source, pop in your affiliate links, and there's your article.